The Huawei Mate 20 is launching in just over a month, and we've just had our first glimpse of the software that'll run on the new flagship. EMUI 9 is based on Android 9 Pie and brings improved performance, faster gaming, a streamlined UI, visual improvements, and digital well-being features. Bear in mind, this is a very early beta version of EMUI 9 that we're seeing here at IFA 2018, so things may well change in the final release. So the new UI sees Huawei building on the foundations of EMUI 8 with a focus on lighter colors and improvements to the consistency of EMUI's look and feel. There are new full screen visuals for alarms and incoming calls to take advantage of the large screens of modern phones, and new artistic illustrations to punctuate the settings app and other preloaded apps. EMUI's settings have also been simplified considerably, surfacing the most useful options at the top of each section and pruning away some unnecessary menu items. And in Huawei's own apps, controls and tabs have been relocated down to the bottom of the screen, where they're easier to reach on large devices like the P20 Pro and Mate 10. As you'd expect in firmware based around Android 9 Pie, there's a new task switching setup based around gesture input. The new gesture navigation system wasn't actually present in the early beta version of EMUI 9 we tried today, but it's likely this will be the default setup in the next Huawei flagship when it arrives. When it's enabled, a swipe up from the bottom bezel opens the recent apps menu or sends you home, and a swipe inward from the left bezel sends you back. EMUI 9 also doubles down on performance. Huawei quotes 12.9% smoother operation in the new version, with app load times also improved considerably compared to EMUI 8. Huawei's GPU Turbo 2.0 feature also promises faster gaming in the new version, further improving on the GPU Turbo feature pushed out to phones including the P20 Pro and Honor 10 in recent months. The new software should also let you track your usage and make it easier to disconnect, with digital well-being features built in as standard. This isn't exactly the same as Google's digital well-being features on the Pixel phones, Rather, Huawei has built out its own interpretation of these features, with the ability to limit app usage and wind down with a greyed out interface when bedtime approaches. And in addition, parents will also be able to set app usage limits for kids. So the EMUI 9 beta process starts today. Huawei announced that the P20, P20 Pro, Mate 10, Mate 10 Pro, Honor 10, Honor View 10, and Honor Play will be able to apply to test this early version of EMUI 9. We can expect the full version to ship later on the Mate 20 with some new features in tow. That's it for now, stay tuned for more on EMUI 9 and the Huawei Mate 20 Pro. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.